Hey guys, today I'm going to talk to you about Netflix's new animated movie, Spellbound, which is out now. So check it out on streaming, but before you do, listen to what I have to say about this movie. Now, first of all, the animation is beautiful. Um, Netflix knows what they're doing when it comes to animation. They very rarely phone it in, especially if it's going to be a feature-length film. So yes, of course, Spellbound is beautiful. It is, you know, Skydance. So Skydance and Netflix coming together. This movie is, is very, very pretty. Now, Rachel Zegler perfectly encapsulates being a princess. I absolutely love her in this. She's Princess Elian. I think I'm saying that not, that right. Elian. Uh, and she is dealing with a big problem because her parents have turned into monsters uh, and she needs to race against the clock to turn them back before it is too late and they remain monsters forever. That really makes the movie feel like it needs to move along, right? You think, oh my gosh, her parents are gonna get stuck like this forever. We need to go. And it sets this like tone of like, hurry up. So because of that, there are a few moments where it feels like the movie kind of slows down. And me personally, like my anxiety was getting to me. And I was like, girl, you need to hurry up. You, you, your parents are gonna get stuck like this. Go, stop taking your time. Stop lollygagging. Like, let's move along. So when the mo when the moments did try to like, uh, you know, take its time and like let people live in the moment. I was like, mm -mm -mm -mm, let's go. So that was a little thing that kind of frustrated me a little bit, but I really did enjoy the story um, as a parent who sometimes doesn't realize the effect that I have on my children and my actions have on my children and my words have on my children um, and things that I'm going through. You know, you, you ooze it out, right? You share it. Sometimes you don't realize that the people in your bubble and the people around you have to deal with your actions and your, even your thoughts and your feelings, right? Um, and so I did really like that message about this or that's weaved throughout this film, especially towards the end. I don't want to get into spoilers, but there are some reveals that I didn't see coming, but I could definitely relate to, not myself personally, but my parents, that is what I will say. Um, I kind of felt like back like a kid a little bit in Elian's shoes for, for some moments. that So that really resonated with me. Um, and I think anyone who's gone through that is going to have that resonate with them as well. Um, but the music here, I mean, come on, it's Alan Menken. Like, are you shocked that the music is good? Because you shouldn't be. The music is so good in this movie. It's catchy. It's fun. Uh, watched it with my 11 and 13 year old and my 11 year old was singing it, singing the songs for a solid like two weeks after. Like she just couldn't stop singing it. And she keeps asking me when it's going to be released on Pottenal, the soundtrack. Um, and I'm like, mm, I don't know what to tell you. Um, but she fell in love with the music. And that's what, that's what this movie is for, right? This movie is for families with a focus on children uh, and ha to have something that parents can take away too. And that is exactly what this movie does. Now, the oracles are so much fun. I mean, Nathan Lane, Titus Burgess, come on. No surprise, right? Obviously, they're great. The two of them together are so much fun. They're so hilarious. Um, I love their relationship, and I love what they bring to this movie. Um, they are basically there to lead her on her journey as she tries to free her parents from this spell, and they are funny. They fight. They bicker. Um, they're cute. They're cute and entertaining and so much fun. John Lithgow's great as well. Don't want to spoil too much about his character. Um, but I like where he ends up pretty early on. And, uh, that's kind of where I'd love for him to stay because he's so much fun. Um, but I just, I, I, Rachel Zegler, powerhouse singer, of course. So I love whenever she opens her mouth, it makes me happy. Um, and I absolutely really enjoyed, uh, her music, the music overall in this, the messaging overall. It's a great, cute, fun family movie um and it's streaming now on netflix so you can watch it over the holidays which i think is perfect so be sure to check it out uh now on netflix let me know if you're excited for spellbound down below in the comments if by the time you got to this review you've already streamed it you've already watched it i mean it's out now you definitely could have uh let me know what you thought down below in the comments be sure to give me a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on more videos like this one Follow me over on Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, and you guys can check me out at mamasgeeky.com. Thanks. I'll see you next time.